Hi my dear friends so in this video we will be talking about tips and tricks for bit set i hope you all have seen your j mains result and it's time to move to a different level of preparation which is bit set first attempt and of course many of you are going to take bit set second attempt also so in this video we'll be talking about the strategies to boost your score my dear friends if we talk about the first thing here comes that mock tests are the most important why it is that because j contains 75 questions to be done in 3 hours bit set contains 130 questions to be done in 3 hours so speed and accuracy it matters a lot and that can be boosted only if you practice mock test so it is very important that you practice mock test even after you know the complete syllabus so j versus bit set if i see the difference comes in the depth and vastness j is much in depth but bit set is quite vast you need to know each and everything if you really want to perform well in bit set you may not know things in much depth as you need to know in j but in bit set you need to know at least the definitions formulas equations they are must so you should not leave anything in bit set preparation dear friends if we talk about theory you must know each and every aspect of the syllabus and your basics should be strong as i told you it's not important that you go on and read things in depth like you do for je mains and advanced not required but you must know theory and strong basics has to be there the first thing which we suggest that you go through your ncert quite well especially in chemistry ncert is the key we can tell you you must go over complete ncert then only you should move to practice other books and mock tests dear friends if you really want to excel in bit set you should practice around 1000 questions of pcm i mean i'm talking about 1000 of physics 1000 of chemistry 1000 of mathematics and how you can do that when go over the ncert then and after that you can start practicing from test series mock test series which is available on our platform also if you see the links are given in the description below you can take master class page bit set test series they are full length mock test series and it gives a very good level of analysis also it can give you a very good level of preparation if you go over each and every mock test and analyze each and every question english and lr if we want to talk about apart from pcm they are generally ignored in our grade 1 and grade 2 and of course in your je coachings and je preparation english and logical reasoning is not taught but they are very very crucial reason is that now you get 30 questions of english and lr so 30 questions means 90 marks are covered by english and lr which can give a big boost to your score and change your bit set score widely so you should not ignore english and lr master class space is offering crash course for english and logical reasoning they are being taught by the experts from iim cozy code and iit delhi the links are given in the description below you can join our crash course to prepare for english and logical reasoning and many students who have joined they are giving very good feedback and in past also students have got much benefited from this crash course so now how to prepare so you should go over the ncert you should make notes by your hand when you make by your hand you remember many other things and these notes are going to be used at the last moment when you are going to just give bit set after one or two days so for revision purpose also these short notes are going to be 
helpful to you if you can make mnemonics of few reactions in organic or organic reactions that's going to be quite helpful to you when i was preparing for my je i i remember still now after many years my teacher taught me some mnemonics like for carbon and reactions he taught that you can remember carbon and reactions like acp ki fast daudti bmw haryana mein dekhi well that's quite fun but acp means endon nazen perkin novenger acp ki fast daudti bmw haryana mein dekhi so it becomes very easy if you can make mnemonics of these reactions similarly we were also taught like nitrine and carbene sits in a car that means nitrine and carbene these are intermediates of car reactions what is car curtius aunt easter reamer teman now curtius in curtius nitrine is the intermediate in aunt easter reamer teman in 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 aunt easter and in reamer teman carbene is the intermediate so if you can make these type of small small mnemonics they are going to be very much helpful to you in memorizing the name reactions and of course the intermediates hopefully you will you will get much benefited by what the example which i gave right now now formula sheet for revision my dear friends this is must for bit set where if you go over each and every chapter it would be better that when you are going over each and every chapter you start writing the formulas of that chapter and those are going to be used at the last moment when you are going to take bit set after one or two days you can write these formulas in a sheet and you can stick those sheets on the wall in front of your study table that's going to be very much helpful so that you know you can again and again revise practice mock te- mock test in timing of exam you must take at least one to two mock tests per day and you should see that they are being covered within the timing of 3 hours where my dear friends take mock test like you are taking a real bit set then it life will become very easy for you when you are going to take real bit set so and bit set is all about time management as everyone knows like if you have to do 130 questions in 3 hours you have to be really really fast and accurate so it's all about time management it's not that you do not know some concept but it is all about the time management how fastly you can do that when you should give like ideally you should give like 35 to 40 seconds per question but in case you are not able to do a question and you within the time of 35 to 40 seconds don't freak out don't get nervous you can move on to the next question don't emotionally attached to a question sometimes we get emotionally attached and we feel that oh this question i know i remember and i have to do it don't get emotionally attached to any of the question like this you have to just move on the aim is to get maximum score no guesswork should be done my dear friend because in the guesswork if you see plus 3 and minus 1 is the thing basically if you get a g- correct then you get plus 3 if you do something wrong a question is g- going wrong you get minus 1 if you do not get good correct answer you get minus 1 mark in the trap of bonus questions my dear friend many students are running behind bonus questions these 12 bonus questions where you will get these 12 bonus questions once you finish on 130 questions and you need to understand that these 12 questions they are difficult in nature they are not they are not of the same difficulty level as that of 130 questions and in order to in order to achieve these 12 questions you don't have to basically rush so i would suggest don't rush to do these bonus questions if you are extremely extraordinary it will come naturally to you but you don't your aim should not be to attempt bonus questions 
even without bonus questions you can score very well and get the best of the best score jay mains and bit set no score correlation when many students we are getting call we are getting query that sir we have got 92 percentile 93 percentile 95 percentile 85 percentile but i can tell you there is no correlation between the jay mains and bit set result at all well of course pcm it's common but sometime it may happen that you are getting less score because of the nervousness that is there in bit side you have english and logical reasoning to cover that so basically if you are getting some if you get if you are not good at some topics of pcm maybe that can be covered by english and logical reasoning so my dear friends don't freak out if you have got less percentile in je mains now you should you should be ready to prepare for bit set quite well and the most important thing is that relax you must sleep for 6 to 7 hours do yoga and meditation do some exercises give time to yourself to introspect what you are studying that's going to be very much helpful in the stressful environment you cannot perform well at all so please relax please take care of your mental and physical health that's very much important during the exam time So my dear friends be ready for bit set you can join our test series you can join our crash course the links have been given in the description below and hopefully you will come out with flying colors thank you so much best wishes to you all of you